Okay, to get started, I just added this video clip to my timeline, and I'd like to animate a circle around the dog. Let's begin by going over to the toolbar, and hold down the cursor on the pen tool. Then select the ellipse tool. Now in your preview, draw a circle around the object you'd like to highlight. And I'm just going to reposition mine a bit so that it covers my dog. Once you have your circle, go over to Effect Controls and open up the shape's properties. Uncheck the fill to turn it off, and turn on the stroke. Click the stroke's color box to change the color of your stroke if you want, I'll set mine to red. Then increase the stroke's number so that you can see your circle properly. Okay, now that we have our circle around our object, let's animate it by going over to the effects panel, and type clock into the search box. Drag the clock wipe transition onto the beginning of your circle's graphic clip on the timeline. Okay, now when I play this back, I have an animating circle, but it animates in a strange way because a clock wipe transition animates from the middle of the frame. To fix this, use a selection tool to move the circle to the middle of the frame. It doesn't have to be perfectly centered, just make sure it animates properly during playback. Next, right click your circle's graphic clip on the timeline, and select Nest. Give it a name if you want, and click OK. Alright, now if you double click your circle in the preview, you can reposition it and it won't mess up the animation. This works because we simply reposition the nested clip, which moved the clock wipe center with our circle. Okay, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.